Hello everybody, Mark here. Today I'm going to be doing another cider review. Now this particular one is by Brothers. It's toffee apple flavour. Toffee apple flavour. English cider. 4% volume, born in a field in Somerset. 500 millilitres. Okay. Now, I'll hold it there while I'm... Uh, I'll read the back to you. There's a little bit of a story in the back. It's made by four brothers in Somerset. A delicious blend of cream soda and smouldering toffee with a rich, creamy aftertaste. Perfect for those who don't do normal cider. Serve chilled over ice and enjoy all year round. There's no gluten-containing ingredients and suitable for vegetarians. There's a brothers for everyone. Yeah. Uh, drink it responsibly. Uh, yeah, yeah. All right. Uh, so it's four percent. So it's. I guess it's kind of low. I guess. Anyway. But yeah. I mean, personally, I wouldn't have gone for um, toffee apple. But I thought you know it's different, and I'll you know I'm doing it for the review. Ordinarily, I wouldn't go for a something like like that. Okay. Anyway, what I did, yeah. What day is it? Sunday today. Yesterday, I went to a. There's a there's a place near me. It's like a little, little. Beer shop, I guess. You go in. There's racks of beer and cider and ale, and you go in and there's chairs. You can sit down. It's not like a pub. It's it's more like a little coffee shop, really. And uh, I purchased this mug while I was in there. Um, yeah, so so this is what I'll be drinking my my cider out of. I think for the time being, I'm gonna I'm gonna retire my Uncle Ben's stir fry glass for the time being. Right. Well, there you go. There's a man. That is a, a rich golden. Ah, there you go. And unlike the Uncle Ben's glass. This actually holds a complete bottle, 500 millilitres. There we go. Hold it there. Yeah, I'll tell you what, it's a rich bronze colour, brass colour perhaps. Not very, uh, what's the word I'm looking for, a carbonated. You know, there's not a lot of carbon, there's very few bubbles coming up. Okay, but uh, yeah, interesting. Oh, that's it. There's a slight sweet caramel kind of odour to it. Yeah, 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 toffee, caramel, butterscotch, perhaps. Yeah, yeah, I'm starting to get into this now, you know. But when, I've <coughs> when I first started um, drinking the drinking the ciders, it was difficult to pick up flavours and smells. You know, you, you could pick up a hint here and there. But, uh, yeah, I'm starting to starting to get the hang of this. Yeah. Yeah, definitely um, a, a toffee butterscotch kind of thing. Anyway, here we go. Well, yeah, that is a toffee flavour. <laughs> Sorry to... Jesus. Um... Not much, uh, yeah, there's not much carbonation, but yeah, there's a strong toffee, strong toffee flavour to it. Now, it says on the label toffee apple, which, uh, I mean, we all like toffee apples, but um, hmm, it's interesting though. I mean, I, I am finding that um, I, I do go for the fruit-flavoured ciders. When I was in that coffee, when that, uh, that, that beer bar, uh, the beer calf, I had two bottles of... I'll tell you what it was. It, it was, uh, well, it was Baxter's. I've got two here. But they had, uh, I had two, two bottles of uh, blackcurrant. So I do lean towards the, the fruit, the mixed fruit and whatnot. This one, I'm not certain it is. Yeah, 
the uh, it, it, it's kind of a weird flavour. Toffee, I mean, don't get me wrong, you know, you know toffee apples. I'm kind of going to get, get in the uh, a toffee a toffee apple pie flavour. That's what I'm getting now. The 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 the, the tone of the flavour sort of change with each sip. Yeah, I, I'm I'm likening this to a an apple and toffee pie. Not crumble, but pie. Yeah, it's. I tell you what, though. Well, while it does taste fairly okay as a one-off, I prefer. I prefer. I don't think I can be. I don't think I can see me drinking this again. Um, purely because it's kind of a. It's a, it's a weird sweet. Apple pie in a drink, I'm not being really too keen on. Yeah, but. Yeah, it's just not my thing. Although I can see this actually being popular, you know, but with. Uh, I, I don't know what. I don't know what meal you would drink this. I mean, if I was having apple pie for dinner, then maybe, you know, go for this. But I can't see me drinking this with a. Any kind of potato and vegetables and a and a pie or meat, you know, like say a carvery or whatever, you know, Sunday dinner. I can't see me drinking this with a dinner. Uh, if, if you were eating a, a mixture of desserts, maybe you know. Yeah, I can't see an occasion where I would actually want to drink this. You know, I mean, it's not, don't get me wrong, it's not an awful flavour. It's just not a flavour for me. You know, it's very unusual. Uh, it's not something that I'm, I would uh, go for. I've drank, I've drunk lagers before, of course. Um, I've drunk a few ciders. There are a few others that I would drink, you know, more often, but, you know, not toffee with apple. Real yeah, boy. Yeah, the apple pie flavour is going, it's more going into the toffee, liquid toffee area now. Yeah, I, I tell you the truth, I, I don't think I'm even going to finish this. Uh, don't, you know, don't get me wrong, it's, it's not an awful flavour, it's just not one for me. Uh, if it was apple, well... They're all pretty much apple flavour, but if it was apple with other flavours, other fruits perhaps, but not toffee. I don't think toffee doesn't work for me. Although I, I do like toffee, chocolate bars, toffee, sweets. Toffee in a drink, I don't think so. Not for me. Anyway, there you have it. The, uh, the Brothers Toffee Apple. Anyway, it's worth a go. Yeah, I mean, I, I pay like uh, about one twenty-five. I think I got it from Tesco. Um, I do have another one I got from a different off-license. This one's mixed fruit. When I empty them, I've got about another six or so in the fridge, being staying cold. And I've got, uh, we've got two, four, six, seven, nine. I've got nine on the side here that uh, I'll be have to get through once I get through the ones, the cold ones in the fridge. But uh, I've got a bit of a mix. So, uh, yeah. So I'll be trying some fruit ones soon. And uh, I'll be trying another one of these brothers ciders and uh you know i'm hoping that'll be slightly better uh okay so just to just to recap uh four percent yeah it's a 500 milliliter bottle this cost i believe 125 and i've i've um, I got it from that was in it because it was in a deal like like you got four of them for five pound 25 or something like that or 120 sometimes i get them from different places okay um yeah, there's not a lot else to say on the subject of that. Uh, it's made in Somerset, you know, so it's one, it's one of the English brands. Okay, then. anyway, there you have it. I'll, I'll uh, hopefully that uh, that's in focus there. And thanks very much for watching. Right, bye bye.